Hello everyone, Scully here from Blue Coconut Family and welcome back to City Skylines tutorial. Today we're going to be looking at undergrounds. So if you remember from the last video we looked at the uh, bus links and more transport around the city. So today, uh, like I said, it's the turn of the underground. So these are often very, very, very useful and popular uh, mode of transport because they're just, they're pretty much invisible um, to you building up a city, you just you know plop them down, connect, connect them up, and go. So this is why I find them very useful for you guys to you know and how to use. So once again, guys, you come to your transport button down the bottom, and then you go to the one which looks like a little kind of carriage here. So not this one. This is a tram. You come to this one, which is metro. So this is underground. Now I've got lots of uh, add-ons installed to make it look like the London Underground. Um, but for today's video I'm just going to be using the default one here which is Metro Station. So these three are your main ones, so you've got the Metro Station, you've got the tunnel and you've got the, uh, the line tool. So first of all you'll notice that the um, tunnel is not um, enabled, that's because you've got to actually place down a Metro Station before you can go on to using your Metro Tunnel and then your line tool. So what we're going to do is we're going to place down couple of these. So what you want to do is you want to place them down in kind of like a loopy kind of area. You can make lines, you can make direct lines um, and I think that's what, actually yeah that's exactly what I'm going to do. So I'm going to do a couple of routes here. Different sides of the city. So these are just going to be straight back and forth like so. So now you can see the tunnel is free. So first, so what you do is you literally go between them, you click, and you click to the next one, and you, and you it's very simple. So another thing which is annoying is after you click um, and you connect them up, it wants you to continue, but you can't continue. So what you have to do is just right click, and it stops building it, and you get to the next one. And you just build your line up round. It doesn't get in the way of your pipelines, doesn't get in the way of anything. The only thing it will get in, in the way of is if you start building... Um, kind of uh, uh, what they're called um, like underground roads and stuff that's the only, really the only thing these will get in the way of um, I've also had a bit of fun when you're trying to dig out terrain and you've got one of these going in underneath it often gets quite entertaining so I'm just going to stick these around here so a lot of these won't be powered uh, simply because uh, power isn't distributed properly around this city but that's fine because I haven't put in any buildings yet because I wanted to get the raw kind of sense of the city so you guys can see me building it um, so uh, I'm not even sure if, this, if these will work without power yeah, we're about to find out so what we're going to do here is we're going to then use the line tool now I want to split this up so I could quite happily do a whole big loop going round what I want to do is I want to do a couple of things so I want to do one which is going this top half the northern line and going back and I want to do the southern line going across so you can go either side of the city so this is going to be my starting point just like the bus link you can see that in the station you have a little dot you click and you go into the next station and you click 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 uh, click 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 so this is where I'm going to stop it on the literally other side now I could continue and go all the way around this way but I'm going to come back so you can see I can click back and it actually swaps to the other side of the station. So just like the, um, the way how the um, your traffic flows, you uh, I set it to left hand drive, so left hand is going forward if that makes sense. And then you can go and go click, click, uh, click, 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 and finishing up. And this will then automatically link up with your first dot. So what we're going to do now is we're going to go back the other way. You can see this is on the other side of the track, so these won't actually intersect with each other, which is good. So passengers passengers can choose which side of the track they go on. Click, 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 and click, and we're going back, just like so. So these will work without power, I've just seen some trains going by. Click, click, and final one, click. So that's beautiful. So all, you can't really see the trains in this, whereas you can see the buses before, and you can also see um, overground trains going by. You can't actually in this see the physical trains moving around, which I find is a little sad. There's no way of actually seeing inside the tunnel. The only way to see it is kind of you're seeing this view, and you just see kind of like a coloured blob 
going along. But it's also where you can see which passengers are going. So we're going to keep an eye on this end station for the moment, just while we get some things going along. So this will be, see, so we got greens on this side, blues on this side, and they're kind of overlapping, which is quite cool. So I'm going to create one more link down, right down the middle. So starting here, and going this way, and this way, 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 and this way, and finishing off here. So this is literally just going to be one route going across the whole thing. So your idea is to try and make a loop. If the loop is impossible, then just make a line. Um, so we're just going across here and up here. Ooh, auto save. Make sure you lag out a little bit, but that's fine. So we're going to stop in there. So that's quite cool. Um, actually, I am going to make this a loop just to show you guys how to do that. So I'm going to have this one here, uh, this one here, here, here. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. So what we're going to do is we're going to just cheat. Go up here. Ooh, this is when it gets a little funny because I've built this quite close to the end. There we go. So I can create a loop even though they're basically millimetres away from each other. So we've got like a, a northbound, southbound, um, we've got the, the uh, centre city loop in the middle. And the great thing with a loop is, um, unlike the other, um, like the northern southbound ones I've got here where it's basically a coloured line on each track, you can actually create two lines within the same track and I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. So what you do here is you grab your line tool and then you work, start working your way around. Uh, around here, around here, 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 Correct new line. There we go. So this is going to be the blue and the kind of pinky, blue and pink. So dark blue and pink. And you're going to see two different coloured um, vehicles going around the uh, track. And we've got a very transport friendly and heavy city. And all of our people will won't even bother taking a car. Hopefully. Uh, the only bit which isn't really transporty heavy with the underground is, yeah, but that's okay. Um, actually, no scratch that, I'm going to build a station here. So I'm going to go you to there, and you to there, and then I'm going to delete this bit in the middle. And just like the bus link, oh, I want to redo, I want to add these. So what you do is line tool, click and drag, click and drag, and now I've got every bit of the city under my influence of transport. So guys, that has been the awesome job and fun. Ignore the power um, symbols, that's because I'm showing you without much power, but the trains are still running underneath quite happily. So that has been my quick tutorial on how to build a metro station, a metro station, a metro line and uh, working underground system just to suit your city. So guys, I've been Scully from the Blue Coconut Family. If you've enjoyed this tutorial or any of our other videos really, hit that subscribe button to be the first person to find out when we do another one, or head to our website bluecoconutfamily.co.uk to find out what else we're doing. Right, see you guys soon, bye!